Good afternoon, everybody. I am Nishana. The subject of our research is the patient's knowledge, attitude, practice on cardiovascular inspectors. This is a survey type research and uh, it is the fourth uh, phase. These are our group members and Dr. Kishwaladan is our supervisor. Uh, first of all, we know that there are different types of uh, non-communicable diseases such as cardiovascular disease, uh, chronic respiratory disease, diabetes and cancer. Among them, cardiovascular diseases are the most important diseases. It includes coronary heart disease, cerebrovascular disease and rheumatic heart disease. Uh, uh, we should know why it is important to assess uh, knowledge, uh, attitude and practice among the patients because uh, in, when we discuss worldwide, the mortality rate is high worldwide due to cardiovascular diseases. When we uh, consider Sri Lanka, according to WHO 2018, death due to NCD is 83% and death due to uh, CVD is 34%. So it is very essential for prevention of CVD. For the prevention, each individual individuals should know uh, about knowledge, attitude, and practice. The main uh, general objective of our research is to describe the knowledge, attitude, and practice regarding cardiovascular risk factors among the patients in, at BMAR. Uh, the, there are three specific objectives. First one is to review the Yunani and modern concept on cardiovascular disease and the second one is to assess the patient's knowledge, attitude and practice on cardiovascular disease factors at the OPD of Bimari. Uh, the third one is to compare the knowledge, attitude and practice on CVD risk factors between CVD and non-CVD patients. Uh, we have gone through these uh, sources in literature study. For our cross-sectional study, we have selected 232 patients conveniently and among them 70 patients are CVD and 162 are non-CVD. We have uh, given a validated and pre-tested uh, questionnaire to them to take data. For assessing the knowledge, <coughs> the questions cover the area regular exercise Diet, stress, family history, and smoking and tobacco. Smoking and alcohol. Uh, for assessing attitude, there uh, we have given ten statements which cover the area of walking habit, maintaining body weight, maintaining healthy mind, smoking and drinking habit, intake of sugar and diet, blood sugar level, lipid level, and blood pressure level. For practice, uh, we have undergone the areas dietary intake, alcohol consumption, tobacco, and physical activities with different categories. Let's see the result and discussion. First, literature review of Yunani. Uh, according to the system of Yunani, our body is made up of, made up of three uh, main factors. When these are in equilibrium, it is considered as the, the state of health. When there is uh, in, in any imbalance, especially in misogyny and ahlat, uh, it causes diseases. Uh, there are several heart diseases mentioned in Yunani texts such as Zofekal, Irtihabekal, Varmekal, and etc. In Yunani medicine, there are special six factors that maintain our health. Uh, if we maintain these six, we can live a healthy life and prevent from many diseases. Those are atmos atmospheric care, food and drink, rest physical activity, <coughs> mental activity, sleep and wakefulness, and elimination and retention. When we consider modern aspect, uh, heart, uh, cardiovascular disease means the dysfunctional condition of heart or an arteries. There are several risk factors uh, which can be class classified as modifiable and non-modifiable. In modifiable, tobacco use, alcohol, unhealthy diet and physical uh, activities. Uh, high blood pressure, diabetes, overweight, sleep demand, stress, in non-modifiable age, sex and family history. This is the sample description of CVD and non-CVD patients of male and female. Uh, this is the uh, description, uh, description 
on uh, age between CVD and non-CVD. And this is the description of family history among CVD and non-CVD patients. Next, we will come to the second objective, assessing knowledge, attitude and practice. First, we will discuss about knowledge. When we discuss about knowledge, we can see uh, nearly uh, 40 patients uh, among 230 patients were with uh, insufficient knowledge. The poor knowledge areas were relationship of, of stress with heart attack, relationship of diabetes, mellitus with heart attack, normal level of fasting blood sugar, normal blood pressure and BMI. This is uh, about attitudes. In the graph you can see 17.24 uh, percentage of uh, patients for, uh, are in uh, lack of attitudes. Uh, the poor attitude areas were relationship of drinking habit with heart attack, relationship of sugar with uh, sugar consumption with heart attack, and relationship of fat meals intake with heart attack. This is the third one: practices related to cardiovascular disease factors. We can see very little amount of patients with uh, low practice. It is uh, 1.72 in percentage. Now we will come to the second object, uh, third objective, the comparison of knowledge, attitude and practice on C CVD respecters between CVD and non-CVD patients. When we comparing the knowledge between CVD and non-CVD patients, we can see uh, there are poor knowledge in non-CVD patients than CVD patients. When we comparing uh, attitude between CVD and non-CVD patient, we can see uh, at uh, we can see about 20 percentage of uh, non-CVD patients. Uh, it is uh, they are in lower than non-CVD patients. Uh, now we will compare uh, practice. When uh, comparing practice, uh, we can see that there is no low practice uh, in CVD patient, but there are very little amount of insufficient practice in non-CVD patient. So uh, our conclusion is, uh, we have identified the unani and modern aspect of uh, cardiovascular, uh, cardiovascular disease and its risk factors and we have identified some uh, differences between, uh, differences in knowledge, attitude and practice on CVD risk factors across CVD and non-CVD patient. But uh, according to Pearson Chi-Star test, uh, we have observed that there are no significant differences observed in knowledge, attitude and practice level of CVD uh, risk factors among CVD and non-CVD when we see in whole uh, population. So our uh, recommendation is we must uh, educate the people regarding uh, atti uh, knowledge, uh, attitude and uh, practice uh, in order to reduce the mortality rate of uh, cardiovascular disease in Sri Lanka. For that we can conduct some awareness programs and etc. So we can prevent the cardiovascular disease and can live a long healthy life.